Welcome to Entered Apprentice 101, answering the most common questions for new Freemasons. If you're just beginning your journey into the world of Freemasonry, you probably have a lot of questions about the Entered Apprentice degree. In this video, we'll explore the most common questions and provide you with the answers you need to confidently embark on your Masonic journey. But before we dive in, make sure to subscribe to the Masonic Audiobook Library for more insightful content like this. Now let's uncover the mysteries of the Entered Apprentice degree together. A young man, John, stands outside a Masonic Lodge, nervously clutching a piece of paper with questions about becoming an entered apprentice. Meet John. He's about to take his first step into the world of Freemasonry as an entered apprentice. Like many others before him, John has questions about this new journey. Today, we'll answer some of the most common entered apprentice questions, providing guidance and inspiration for those who are just starting their Masonic path. 1. Understanding the NTRED Apprentice DGRE the Entered Apprentice degree is the first of three degrees in Freemasonry. It represents the beginning of a Mason's journey towards self-improvement and enlightenment. Let's dive into some frequently asked questions about this important step. Question 1. What is the purpose of the Entered Apprentice degree? Answer. The Entered Apprentice degree serves as an introduction to the world of Freemasonry. It teaches the candidate the basic principles, values, and symbolism of the craft, laying the foundation for further growth and development. Question 2. How should I prepare for the Entered Apprentice degree? Answer. To prepare for the Entered Apprentice degree, it's essential to have an open mind and a genuine desire to learn. Familiarize yourself with the history and values of Freemasonry and be ready to embrace the teachings and lessons that will be presented to you. Question 3. What can I expect during the Entered Apprentice ceremony? Answer. The Entered Apprentice ceremony is a solemn and meaningful event. It consists of a series of rituals, symbols, and allegories designed to impart moral and ethical lessons. While the specifics of the ceremony vary between lodges, you can expect to be guided through the process by experienced masons who will help you understand the significance of each step. Question 4. What happens after I become an entered apprentice? Answer. After becoming an entered apprentice, you'll begin your journey of self-improvement and personal growth. You'll attend lodge meetings, participate in Masonic education, and work on understanding the lessons and symbolism associated with the Entered Apprentice degree. As you progress, you'll be encouraged to reflect on your own life and apply the teachings of Freemasonry to become a better person. Question 5. Will I have a mentor to guide me through the Entered Apprentice stage? Answer. Yes, most lodges assign a mentor or coach to new Entered Apprentices. This experienced Mason will help you navigate the early stages of your Masonic journey answer your questions, and provide guidance and support as you learn and grow within the fraternity. Question 6. How do I progress to the next degree in Freemasonry? Answer. To progress to the next degree, you'll need to demonstrate a thorough understanding of the Entered Apprentice degree's teachings and symbolism. This may involve completing a series of educational requirements, participating in lodge activities, and demonstrating your commitment to the values of Freemasonry. Once you've met these requirements, you'll be eligible to advance to the Fellow Craft degree. Now, as an entered apprentice, it's essential to remember that the journey of self-improvement and personal growth is a lifelong process. Be patient with yourself and embrace the lessons and experiences that come your way. Question 7. What if I feel overwhelmed or unsure about my progress as an entered apprentice? Answer. It's normal to feel overwhelmed or uncertain at times during your Masonic journey. Remember that you have the support of your mentor and fellow Lodge members who are there to help you learn and grow. Don't be afraid to ask questions and seek guidance when needed. Embrace the process and trust that with time and dedication, you'll continue to progress and develop as a Mason. As we've seen through John's journey, becoming an entered apprentice is an exciting and transformative experience. By asking questions, seeking guidance, and embracing the teachings of Freemasonry, you too can embark on a path of self-improvement, enlightenment, and personal growth. Remember, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Good luck on your Masonic journey, and may it be filled with wisdom, growth, and lasting friendships. Subi ascribe e to May Sonice A U D I O B O O K Library. Thank you, K W A N E A G Y A R E.